you. Vanakam Chennai. Women's Rights Conference. Talapati M.K. Stalin Anna. Durga Anni. Mehbuba Mufti Ji. Priyanka Gandhi Ji. Dimpal Yadav Ji. Subhashini Ali Ji. Ani Raja Ji. Leshi Singh Ji. Rakhi Bidlan. Sushmita Dev. Anubi Sadagiri Kanimoli. Helen Davidson. Namakkal Rani. All the honorable MPs, ministers, media, DMK leaders, and policy makers. I thank the DMK for hosting this most wonderful event today here. And when I stand here, I must, when I start my speech, pay great honors and respect to Periyar, Annadurai, Kalegnar. Karunanidhi ji on his centenary year, Chhatrapati Shivaji Shahu Phule Ambedkar, which is the legacy we work, and a very special moment, Sena Tamila Enuma Podinile Imbatetan Vanda Payuda Kadanile. What I have been told this means is Tamil is a very sweet language and it's like sweet honey when you get. So Tamil, which is a beautiful language, which I fortunately in Parliament am surrounded by DMK. There is Baluji, our leader, who sits in the front, Sonia ji, who sits in the front. Then I have Raja, I have Daya. I have all Sumati, my friend, who sits right behind me, Jyoti Mani. I have all my other friends. I was listing them out. Shabir, who sits right next to me. My younger brother, who's sitting right next to you. All of them, Karti Chidambaram. So sometimes I'm confused whether I'm in NCP or I'm in DMK because I'm surrounded only by DMK. And I'm going to request Stalin Anna that we are fighting for our party and symbol in Maharashtra. So if Maharashtra doesn't get a ticket, I know one ticket I will get is from DMK in the Tamil Nadu. Yes. But it's really wonderful to be here because Tamil Nadu has a rich legacy. It's a state which has done social justice. The state which I come from, of Shau Pule Ambedkar's, you have the same rich legacy of Periyar, Anna Durai, and of Karuna Didiji. So we feel very proud and I was very blessed and lucky to meet Karuna Didiji whenever he came to Delhi. So I had the opportunity to take his blessings and learn few things and the opportunity to work with his children who have such a big legacy of the DMK party. So it's an honor for us to be here. And the beauty of DMK and Tamil Nadu is that here I asked somebody today before coming here, what are the few things the Tamilian pride is? They said our pride is of social justice. We are proud of our language. There is no caste, no religion. It's only our language which fills us together. And I would like to tell Talapati Stalin Anna one thing. That's one thing that the entire DMK in India's pal parliament stands for is their proud Tamil legacy that they're proud of. Whatever issues are raised, always Honorable Balaji is always leading, be it the MBBS exam, he's always first leading and fighting with the BJP. He's always fighting. No forcing Hindi on us. We are proud Tamilians. We like our language. Hindi is welcome. English is welcome. But you cannot take the Tamil away from the Tamilians. So I think it's a very proud community with a rich legacy. And there is one most big contribution which you all have done, which Kalingar has done, is they have not only taken Tamil language ahead, but even the technical words in schools used 
were started by Kalingar. So there are technical language. So you have really brought it down to the basics. So you all are really proud of your language. And it's so wonderful to see that there is no caste, no religion. It's only what unites Tamil Nadu is the love for their language. So proud Tamilians, I am a proud Maharashtrian who has a lot of pride. And right now the way the invasion from Delhi that I call Adrusha Shakti means it's an invisible power of Delhi which is attacking the cooperative federalism of this country. The way Tamil Nadu is fighting, Swa, we fighting in Maharashtra and unitedly Tamil Nadu and Maharashtra will make sure that nobody will go against our cooperative federalism and take away our rights from us.